Happy National Day, Singapore! My name is Joel, and this is the National Food Bro Food Review Channel. Over here, I review local food as well as food around Southeast Asia. So today, I've ordered satay from Heron Satay at East Coast Lagoon Hawker Centre. It's really crowded today, as well as Spice, satay from Spice, and Spice is at Simpan Bedok. Okay, so what is satay? So satay is actually little pieces of meat, can be chicken, can be beef, can be mutton, placed in uh, wooden sticks. The uncle will grill it right over a uh, charcoal, and they put some oil over it, right? So it's actually uh, from far, you can see the smoke and, and the smell is very strong. So satay usually comes with gravy, right? So the gravy has a lot of peanut, right? It's very thick, but some gravy is a little bit uh, more watery, so we'll compare today. So let's kickstart and try the chicken satay from Heron. Now you can feel the a little bit sweet, but this is normal, right? So normally satay is a little bit sweet, it's tasty, you know, it's not very salty. No, just a little bit sweet. Okay, let's try the chicken satay with the gravy, okay? And see the difference, ah? Huh? Mm. Oh, there's a really a huge difference. So when you put the gravy, there's so many different types of taste there, right? There is like the peanut taste, the sweet taste, the salty taste, you know. And this gravy is very thick. And the gravy is not so oily because some places, right, the top layer of the gravy is actually pure oil, right? And usually satay, right, they'll give the cucumber, the onion, and the rice cake right, or the ketupat. So same thing, usually we'll just put it with the gravy, right? And this gravy is really nice. Mm, very sweet, right? So this is more towards the sweet side. If you like sweet food or sweet peanut gravy, you'll like this. Definitely fall in love with it. Also, the onion is also nice. When I was uh, younger, right, so whenever my dad were to bring home a satay, right, what I'll do is that I will take all the satay and put onto my plate, eh, because you know why not? It's very fast. Right? So my brother will eat, my mom will eat, my dad. So I'm afraid that there's no more satay left. So I've tried uh, one satay without the gravy and one with the gravy. I think with the gravy is nicer. So same thing, I'll do it likewise for uh, spice, right? The chicken satay. Taste-wise, it's not very like hard and stiff, or maybe because it's chicken. My all-time favorite is chicken because it's not so hard as compared to like maybe beef or pork, right? Let me just finish this first, ah. Huh? Mm. Slightly smaller in size as compared to heron. Okay, now with the gravy, with the gravy, yeah. So this is more watery, maybe more sauce. Okay, but I will try. More oily, not as sweet. And over here, as spice, when you take away, right, there isn't any ketupat, there isn't any cucumber, there isn't any onion, which I feel is rather important to me, okay? Let's try Heron's mutton. Mm, steeper. So generally, it's sweet, uh, similar to a chicken. But the bad thing about satay is sometimes uh, when the meat is very tough, right, it gets stuck in my teeth, you know, like, ayo. So now, anyway, the mutton with the gravy. I love the gravy here, very thick, very peanutty. Generally with the peanut, right, somehow I don't know why, but the meat feels softer. Maybe the sauce like fused into the meat and it softens it instantly, you know. I really love the onion, you know. The onion with the peanut sauce, right, is really uh, heavenly. Why 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 we need all this? Because when you eat too much meat, right, sometimes you feel very like gelat. With some vegetable over here, right, it really neutralizes the feeling. So I feel it's important. This is the beef, right? The beef from spice. Ah, this is so tough, eh? Very tough. It's very tough. So I think this is the toughest, the beef. No wonder now I understand why from young my mom only gives chicken. Because I think maybe when, as a kid, right, if you take too tough, right, maybe you will get choked. Wave the sauce now. Mm. So the beef with the sauce is also very tough, okay? And of course, I mentioned before, oily, yeah, the sauce. Okay, so National Food Bro gives uh, Heron Satay 5 out of 5 stars, Spice Satay 4 out of 5 stars. So I, I just compared the, the chicken satay because it's a common one. So the chicken satay here is a little bit sweet, right? So I, I prefer the sweeter version. And the meat over here is a bit larger. The satay over here at Spice, is, the meat is a little bit smaller. Uh, for Heron, they provided the, the onion, which I think plays a part. The onion, the cucumber and the ketupat, right? So it, it, it's really a full satay meal, okay? For the gravy, I also prefer Heron because it's thicker, not so oily. I think it's very important because uh, the meat is really oily and then if the gravy is oily as well, right, you have a very oily feeling, right, when you try the satay. Okay, this is my review for Heron Satay at East Coast Lagoon Hawker Centre as well as Spice Satay at Simpang Bedok. What do you think? 
leave your comments below. And remember to hit like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and if you have any satay to recommend, also leave your comments below. My name is Joel from the National Food Bro Food Review Channel. I will see you soon. Goodbye.